this is just perfect. Bobby and I have been sent out on a dangerous mission to retrieve a priceless artifact hidden in the Snood Candy Factory. But Mr. Snood has really beefed up his security since the last time we were here. It's like Fort Knox. And what is this priceless artifact anyway? Apparently it's something Bobby's dad hid in the factory when he was 10. Something that's super important to Bobby's dad. <laughs> What could it be? Well, come on, let's go find out. <sighs> I'm really glad we stopped by the Pflugerville Hamburger Shack on the way over here. All this superhero stuff is making me hungry. I'm especially fond of the Flarsh Marfler Milkshake. It's darn near life-changing. <laughs> I can't believe Mr. Snood built a fence around the whole place and even covered the top with chicken wire. We can't fly in, so what are we going to do? How would you look at that? He put a whole bunch of signs up. Let's see what these things say. <clears throat> do not enter. Stand back. Run away. Be gone with you. Why are you still standing there? We think you're dumb. Oh, well, that's just rude. Uh-oh. You and your giant sign-reading voice have woken up the guard dog. It's coming out of the doghouse. Look at the shadow on that thing. It's gigantic. <laughs> oh, that is one angry little dog. <laughs> Calm down there, buddy. <laughs> Don't get near it. These chihuahuas are deadlier than shark-infested water. Oh, calm down, Grabstack. I think she's hungry. Let's give her some of your milkshake. Oh, sure. Take grab stack stuff. He won't care. You're being a tiny bit dramatic. We talked about this. Well, I am a theater director. It's my job to be dramatic. <sighs> okay, fine. Here you go, you little monster. <laughs> well, <laughs> would you looky there. Our four-legged friend likes Flarsh Marfler milkshakes almost as much as I do. <laughs> and I can feed it to him through the straw. <laughs> I tamed the beast. <laughs> oh, okay, little buddy, calm down. <laughs> no, 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 you cannot have any more. Get, get, just get back, you beast, get back. <gasps> oh, it's digging under the fence. Save the milkshake. Calm down, my best good buddy. This is perfect. We give this tiny dog our Flarsh Marfler milkshake to keep him busy, and then dig under the fence. He showed us how to overcome the impossible. Oh, why don't you just take my pants while you're at it? Fine. Take the milkshake. See if I care. But I'm going to remember this next time I need a favor. I have no doubt. Come on, let's get digging. I'm super curious what the secret artifact is. It could be anything. Well, we know it's important, that's for sure. <laughs> it's a big assignment. Something my dad hid in the Snood Candy Factory when he was my age. And we have this nifty map to show us the way. I love adventures. Oh, it's all fun and games till some dog drinks your Flarsh Marfler milkshake. Keep it down, Grabstack. Mr. Snood might hear us and then come over here with the flamethrower and blowtorch our butts off. Hang on, wait. Could that actually happen? Someone call my agent! Okay, we're inside. Uh, now what? Well, you tell me, Mr. Smarty Pants. Hold on. Let me get my binoculars out of my fanny pack. Fanny pack? You're a superhero. You can't fly around with a dang fanny pack. Sure I can. I'm a trendsetter. Fanny packs are on a comeback. And it holds my binoculars just right. Now, let me just get a good look around. Wow. The Snood Candy Factory is really far away. Um, you're looking through the wrong end of the binoculars? We talked about this, Bobby. Oh, right. Okay, here we go. That's interesting. Ooh, what is it? Tell me! There's a little window open way up there next to the roof. But if I try to fly up there, I'll probably miss and hit the side of the factory. Uh, the odds are not with you. I agree. But I could climb up the side of the factory using these cool suction cup gloves my mom gave me. Apparently, she liked to crawl up walls when she was ten. It was her thing. That sounds completely impossible and totally weird. So, of course, I love it. Or we could try to hack our way through one of the walls. Did you bring a machete or a chainsaw? Nope. But I do have this pair of fingernail clippers. <sighs> Let's go with plan A. Okay, let's sneak over to the building while I put these cool suction cup gloves on. Ready? Oh, I'm always ready, Palomino. This little 
adventure's getting dangerous already, and we're not even inside the factory yet. <laughs> Whatever we're finding better be worth it. We're going to climb up the side of the factory while you take a quick breather. If you see my Flarsh Marfler milkshake, would you bring it to me? Welcome back to Bobby Wonder. We find ourselves climbing up the side of the Snood Candy Factory using Bobby's incredible suction cup gloves. Oh, it's all very exciting, but it's about to get downright dangerous. Let's get back to the action as Mr. Snood shows up right underneath us. Hold up, Bobby. Here comes Mr. Snood. Don't move. He's right under us. Where's my guard dog, Brutus? Brutus! I'm down to one hand, Grabstack. Hang on, or we'll land right on top of him. <laughs> oh, there you are, Brutus. And what is this now? You've got milkshake on your face, and you didn't share with me. Oh, that is very upsetting. Now stay here and keep an eye out. I have a feeling that Bobby Wonder might try to visit me again, and we cannot have that. <sighs> Phew! That was a close call. I hope you enjoyed drinking my entire Flarsh Marfler milkshake, Brutus. You little stinker. <laughs> Almost to the window. And we're here. Oh, this place is in full tilt, no holds barred, out of control production. Conveyor belts are humming everywhere. And ginormous vats of frothing, fizzing, boiling flues. At least Mr. Snood won't be able to hear us. Heck, I could scream at the top of my lungs and he wouldn't even know we were here. Hey, Mr. Snood, we're up here. See, he can't hear us at all. What are you doing up there, you bozo? Oops. We better move fast before he figures out how to stop us. Mm, hold on, let me get this map out of my fanny pack and take a look at where we're going. Get down from there. Don't make me get the forklift with the robotic arms. Hey, that sounds pretty cool. I want to drive it. Stay focused, Bobby. We're on the clock here. Oh, my word. That is a very detailed map. <gasps> it's a beast. Yeah, my dad tends to overdo the instructions. Like, right here in the corner, he wrote, eat your vegetables. And over here, it says, don't climb through the window at the top of the factory. You'll never make it from there. Oh, well, that's unfortunate. Let's remember to read the instructions first next time. We're sunk! No way! You're Bobby Wonder! If anyone can do it, you can! Also, I should probably mention that Mr. Snood's now driving the forklift with the robot arms towards us! He just drove into a giant tank of Snood flues! And a pallet of boxes! Oh, and a conveyor belt. You'll never pass the driver's test, dude. Time to roll. We need to get all the way to the other side of the factory where this big red X is on the map. And then up into the rafters, and then a tunnel, and then we should find what we're looking for. That sounds simple enough. Ooh, look, Mr. Snoo just picked up a megaphone. Deploying robot arms. This is your last chance, Bobby Wonder. Come down. Time to get a move on, my best good buddy. Hang on. Seatbelts, engage. Here comes the robot arms. We're taking the conveyor belt route down to the factory floor, then jumping over that fat of snood flues, then across to that ladder, grab that pipe over there, swing like a monkey and grab that hook hanging from a wire, then fling across the open space like Tarzan, land on that other conveyor belt, run like the wind, and that'll put us at the tunnel. Easy peasy. Hold on, I'm writing all this down. Now what happens after the first conveyor belt again? Also, how do you spell conveyor belt? <laughs> oh, this darn pen is running dry. Where's my agent? <laughs> he made it to the conveyor belt. Now, we just have to slide down this thing and get to that vat of snood flues. Woo-hoo! Sliding down a conveyor belt is fun! Mr. Snood's chasing us on the forklift! Duck! Here comes the robot arms! I'll get you, Bobby Wonder! Just you wait! Hey, 
time to leap over the vat of snood blues and get to the ladder. He's got a grip on your cape! Hang on! I'll take care of this pesky robot problem. I just gotta climb up on your shoulder. I got my handy dandy pea shooter here. Always carry a pea shooter. <laughs> Come on, people, keep up! Don't oh, ow! Direct hit! Someone caught me in the forehead with a pea! I'm under attack! <laughs> This is a disaster. I'll get you, Bobby Wonder. Come, Bobby, he's coming back. And now he's covered in snood flues. He's not a very happy camper. Here we go. Time to grab those pipes and then swing like a monkey. <laughs> Woo, we're almost there. And crawl down this tunnel until we get to... There it is. Ooh, it's smaller than I expected. Just a teeny little box. Wonder what's inside. No time to check now, but it'll fit perfectly in my fanny pack. Now we just have to do the same thing all over again to find our way to the window. If I may suggest, how about if we just hit the fly button and take our chances? If we miss the window, we'll probably crash right through the wall. <laughs> That'll work. But then we damage the factory. We can't have that. Nope. We head back the same way we came, like responsible superheroes. Well, that was quicker than I expected. I know, right? It's always easier the second time. Let's head outside and get under that fence. My dad is waiting for this very important artifact. Onward, Bobby Wonder! Don't come back, Bobby Wonder. No kids allowed at the Snood Candy Factory. And that's final. No problem, Mr. Snood. And sorry about your forklift. Oh, now I have to hose it off. Scram! Let's fly. <laughs> no more Flarsh Marfler milkshake for you, Brutus. Until we meet again. Wow. I really stuck that landing. I'm getting better. Right. Whatever helps you sleep at night, Bobby Wonder. Come on, let's find my dad and give him the good news. He's going to be so psyched we found the artifact he hid a million years ago. Oh gosh, I wonder what it is. It could be anything, like a magic ring or a jewel with the power to move mountains. Ooh, this is very exciting. Hey, Dad, we found it. We found the artifact hidden at the Snood Candy Factory. No way. Yes way. Oh, I can't believe it. After all these years, I'm finally going to get it back. Oh, it's very exciting. A dog drank my Flarsh Marfler milkshake. It was terrifying. Hey, that's a nice fanny pack. It goes nicely with the cape. Don't encourage him. We don't need all the extra luggage when we're out trying to save Pflugerville from Mighty Mila. Here you go, Dad. Open it up. Okay, here it goes. Oh, it's still there. I can't believe it. What is it? Well, it's the very last cherry-flavored ring pop the Snood's ever made. And look, it has some mold on it now. Mm. It's a little, uh, a little furry, but still tastes oh so good. Mm. Mm. You have really outdone yourself this time, Bobby Wonder. I have to go show Mom. Bev! Bev! You're not gonna believe this! Bobby found my cherry-flavored ring pop! Don't say it. Are you kidding me? A cherry-flavored ring pop? Oh, uh, the least he could have done was hide one with a better flavor, like Floffermelon! Uh... What's flour from barfin? Flour from melon. Flour flour melon. Uh, no, 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 no. It's flopper melon. It's floor for watermelon. Ooh, I do love watermelon. <sighs> well, it wasn't what we thought it would be, like some new power or anything cool like that, but you know what? What? I think it was better than anything like that. You are a strange child, Baba Wonder. I haven't seen my dad light up like that in who knows how long. It really made him happy, and we made that happen. Isn't that really what our whole mission is? Making the people of Pflugerville happy? You know, I, I think you're right. We did make somebody happy today. Bravo us! Yeah, bravo us! Come on, let's go get you some flaffermelon. Oh, now you're talking.
That was really cool when we climbed up the wall and slid down the conveyor belt and swung like a monkey. By the way, I'm keeping this fanny pack. It is definitely on trend and a good look. Well, I lost a perfectly good Flarsh Marfler milkshake, but I did get to use my pea shooter and eat some fluffer melon. Not a bad day, all in all. <laughs> Tune in next time as Robozuki shows up and uses his eyeball tractor beam to pile up every bicycle in Pflugerville. Oh, and if you're waiting for the next Bobby Wonder episode, go check out Lucy Wow. She's got her own show. <clears throat> now where'd I put that pencil? Oh, I need to write this all down. Heck, might even make a play out of it. Quiet on the set, people. Quiet on the set. Bobby Wonder! If you enjoyed this podcast, please give us a five-star rating and review, and be sure and tell your friends. Go, kid, go. Go, kid, go.